All right. So I'm gonna get back to this painting. This is a uh, part of the garden where I grew up in. My mom is uh, proud of all of her flowers. She took this photo and um, apparently all these little things are called scalia, I think. So I call it Sandy's Garden with Scalia. And it's based on a photo. Here, I'll show you the shape. It's kind of <clears throat> low res, so I, I don't mind that it's low res because I just wanted the general idea. So here's the uh, photo that I'm looking at. And I'm just going to put it over here, off to the side. Um, so what I'm thinking about is doing some, I don't know, I just, I got to do some stuff. So yeah, I just, it's, it's it looks kind of bland, doesn't it? Like I like this up here, it's kind of cool. Uh, these I'm gonna work on now. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do something. That's what I'm gonna do, something. So I'm gonna get some browns. <clears throat> I think all this stuff is pretty, oh, no, I was gonna say it's dry, but it's not dry, really. That's why I like oils. They stay wet for a while. So I'm gonna get a collection of browns. <clears throat> Over here on this side, I've got a whole set of, oh, that's a good brown, okay. All right, well, so I've got, Things. Where's my white? God damn it, I always lose the white. Here it is. Okay. So I'm going to create a couple of one, two, three, four, five, I don't know, a bunch of whites. And uh, I don't know. I think I kind of want to go on the inside of these. Oh, this is all dry now. It's been so long since I touched this painting. Okay, that's let's see what kind of brown. Yeah, I'm definitely in one of those babbling stages. For what I'm saying. Okay, a different brush. I'm gonna choose this brush, which I was using earlier today. On the big, the other one, the uh, birch is the orange. Okay, here's a kind of nice brown. Now, definitely with this painting. I'm, um, the paint is applied a lot thinner, so I, I think I'm going to want to go on and add some thick spots. To get my stupid face out of the way, there we go. I'm not really following the picture, I just, I just my gut tells me that there's something ugly about these things and uh, there's one really neat painting by Peter Doig where he he took a it was a painting of a house in Rosedale of all places and what I kind of remember I got to go back and look at it again but what I remember was he had a lot of uh, kind of like this these branches all interweaving in front of a of a pay, of a house, so that's kind of what I'm thinking about right now. It had a really neat effect. Okay, so that's toning down that stuff a bit, and I think, yeah, what's wrong with this painting? I think I'm gonna go and I'm gonna try doing. A little spritz is a color. Spritz is a color. I'm basically just hiding. Oh, I don't feel like talking. Too much goddamn work. So 
I'm just making it up. Yeah, I think what I want to do is I just want to make more fun abstract shapes and patterns. It's like my MO. Like I'm gonna come in here and I'm gonna let's get some thick paint, shall we? Let's get some thick paint. Okay. Okay. Yeah, who cares about the photo? Let's just get in here and start creating something. I'm just gonna let my hand do the, the walking. Can you even see this? I'm just gonna let my hand do the walking. Let it create the scene. I've got this kind of gentle yellow. I don't know, color green. Actually, I just sort of took what was already on the canvas. Okay, I know I'm very close to the speaker, so you probably hear it loud. Okay, if you hear this weird sound, that's just me tapping, it's just touching the canvas. do is get a bit more a bit more sense of depth and I want to cheat by making my own designs so I'm just gonna kind of go with what I already had here and do some painting stuff around it Yeah, and I'm adding texture too. I'm definitely going to go in and let the paint thicken up. I think that's what was missing. should do some intentional stuff like I look at the picture and there's a bunch of vertical kind of planty thing in my shitties maybe I'll add some around here and what's kind of cool is I'm just gonna go <laughs> whatever comes off my uh, little canvas whatever I mean my, my palette thing whatever you want to call this freaking thing <clears throat> So there's a bit of pink there. I'm just going to grab that pink and I'm going to let it become part of the painting. Now when I do this I got to remember to step back because uh, sometimes I get kind of lost in getting close and doing what I think are all kinds of fun little details. But <clears throat> when you step back they may not work. I'm just reminding myself to do that. Should that even be there? Ah, fuck it. It is now. Okay. Yeah, see, it's already maybe becoming... Okay, I, get, I gotta vary up the brush strokes. <clears throat> like, what if I just did this? Come in here. With this. It's almost like a creamy brown. Oh, nugget. I heard your little moan. Some blues. Oh, that's purples actually. 
That's kind of nice. I think, yeah, I'm gonna come in with darker colors at some point. I'm not sure where or when. I just wanna play with this stuff for a bit. Tap all you like. Thanks for sharing. Love this one as well. Hey, thanks. Is one of the hardest decisions when to stop, man. <laughs> it does feel like winter today. Like you're painting. Yeah. I don't know if you guys noticed. I don't know. I'm in Toronto. But uh, to just yesterday, in one day, it felt like fall. Like it went, suddenly was chilly. And uh, got to break out the pants soon. Okay. How about this purple? Oh, my air conditioning just turned on. That's weird. Just as I was talking about how cool it was. Oh, look at that. I don't know if that's too intense there. Oh, let's just do that. What if I want this? Mixed it in there. It's as if it was grass. Why the hell not, right? Fuck it. <clears throat> I have like an X rated mouth. This is an ugly piece of crap right over here. So let's just do something with it. Why don't I mess around? Oops. Okay, so did say I was going to make it more intense. So let's go and make it more intense. First of all, these things are still pissing me off a bit here. These branches, they're just, even though they are black in the, in the, in the photograph, I just don't like it. I don't like it. I'm going to make them all lighter. Definitely like going purpley. Okay. Let's try this blue. Oh, that's kind of a nice blue. Okay. Right. Let's try thicker. Get in one of these darker. That blue with that green looks great, doesn't it? Now here, I'm gonna come in with some heavier greens in a second, but I just wanna, I like these blues, so I'm gonna spike up this whole area with it.
Because look at these weird white things. Let's just circle them with colors. See if that does something. Okay. Um, yeah, like even, if, even in here, I could probably put some blues. Even though that should, probably should be more green. I'm not crazy about this a little bit, so let's just take some of that here. You know, it's needing it's needing a, a bit of crazy shit. It needs like a bit of a right. You know what I'm talking about? I thought you were green. Too blue. Where's the green? It's, it's got so much of that. I need a different green. Ah, let's use this green. Oh, God damn it. A little bit of weight with the screen when we do that. Wow, just that touch it. Touch it. I just touch the white and it um, super creamified my paint there. Hmm. <clears throat> what the heck? is this? Is this a shadow or is this a some glass? Let's just jazz up. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna take a look. Move it back a bit. Let's see. So I'm looking at it on my computer here. I can see the whole thing. Nice. Who makes those noises? Is the cartoon Martian? Yeah, it's definitely me, man. So, oh, the cartoon Martian. You're thinking of the little. <clears throat> I know what you're talking about. That cute little guy. Isn't Marty the Martian or something? That's like super old school. Okay. Um, I don't know what I feel like. What do I feel like doing? Add some browns in here, would that look good? Yeah. Take some of those browns. Yeah, this whole upper area, I don't know what the fuck I'm gonna do with this whole thing. Uh, I gotta be honest, I love swearing. Feels good. Just, I guess I'd rip somewhere. Okay. Hmm. What am I going to do about you? 
Why are you so ugly? I'm talking about this section of the paint up here, painting up here. Why are you so ugly? Here, I'm going to put some ugly greens in there because you're pissing me off. Okay, what if I took some of this color and just slapped it on my hair? If I just drew a line across like that. Horse again, Marvin the Martian. Yep, Marvin the Martian. <clears throat> Some, what the hell? You're kind of bugging me. I don't know what it is. Put some big chunks of color. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not sure what I'm going to do up here. I'm a little bit stumped. Ha, huh, stumped, get it? I don't know, just not feeling this. These twisty trees are just these twisty trees are just what if I did some sort of weird painting over thing? What if I just lighten them all up? Let's just add this weird green. <sighs> I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know what I'm doing. That's an ugly green. Let's fix you a bit. Yeah, maybe there's some color coming through here. Circles. Let me just draw some dots. I'm just gonna draw some random. Circles. Blonk, 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 Random circles. They don't make any sense. I don't give a shit. God, it's a color. Okay. Well, maybe I should do some of those circles down here. Maybe that's what I'm supposed to do. Couple of happy little circles. Hello, happy circles. Little, look at them. See it? Little, little cute little guys. <clears throat> I don't know why. I just feel like doing little circles down there. Oh, look at this pink. Look at this pink. Oh, uh, this feels like a mistake. Yep, that's a mistake. Why don't we try some pink up here? Where is that pink? Okay. Hmm. Just cover it up. No one will no one will know. No one will notice. Okay, got some more talking down here. I think it looks great. Put in a bench. Fuck no, I'm not putting a bench in. What kind of crazy talk is that? I'm putting a bench. Crazy, insane people on the internet, Cheryl. Talking about benches.
Oh, goddamn benches. My goddamn paintings. <clears throat> okay. No, oh, this is my parents' backyard, man. I used to play football in here. We used to throw the football stuck in there. My mom used to always freak out that we were, my brother and I were stomping on her flowers. Didn't know what the hell they were called. <clears throat> I thought they were called bluebells. But I'm wrong. <clears throat> okay. Um, do, 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 do. Let's look, let's take me along kind of quick. Okay, let's go here. Let's do some nice swirls. Yeah, I don't know what the like, what the effect's gonna be like, but I'm going in with this circles circles yeah I know I am rude ah, fuck it what are you gonna do uh, that's uh, yeah I guess I, I guess I get more comfortable because whenever I get more comfortable or start getting more <clears throat> obnoxious and I like to joke around a lot. So go fuck yourself. I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm just kidding. This mic is going to be my downfall probably, right? Yeah, that's kind of neat. Okay, stand back. Well, okay, so hmm, I'm digging this up here, and I think that's it's, it's trying to be too too perfect. So let's make it less perfect. Let's just get up there and make it unperfect. Do some brushstrokes that just piss you off. What the? the <clears throat> yeah, that's like a Chagall kind of stuff. Let's do some Chagall stuff. Let's just take this and smosh it. Smosh it together. Get rid of some of those uh, little dainty brush strokes. Just smosh. It's a word I'm just making up right now. Come on, that's what I'm talking about. Look at this. Just blur it up a bit. Yeah, it was too perfect. It was too it too much. Like I'm trying to be do Van Gogh stuff. I need to do my own thing. So let's invent the smosh, which I said that I just stole from Chagall. Maybe it's got some wetness in there. What if I just took some wet paint and fuck it, just let it drip down? What was that gonna do? Oh no! Right? I'm not sure if I like that white. White is just looking too perfect. So let's put some kibosh on that white. And then you down here, too perfect. I think, actually, that's where the pink might come in nice. Bam! You want some pink? I'll give you some pink. It's just as long as it's not a bench. Kind of insane person talking about benches. <clears throat> okay, all right. Uh, love the sound effects. Damn right, the sound effects are awesome. <clears throat> what if I just went and I'm gonna go up here and do some drawing around these shapes 
that color isn't nice enough. Let's get let's get a real happy pink going. Oh, look at this. It's almost like a violent pink. Okay, I kind of like that. I like that. Let's get that more of that pink in there. I don't know what a pink is doing up the, in, a, in a wall over here, but it is what it is. I'm gonna put more pink over here. Yeah, I just I just like thick brush strokes. That's it. I like thick brush strokes. I like to make a painting that's just a bunch of bunch of thick brush strokes. <laughs> this be fun to do. So I'll circle these things a bit. Get thirsty. The other tree, or not tree, the other kind of plant thing in my parents' backyard are these amazing, I always thought they were lilac bushes, and they smell incredible. They're giant, puffy, pink things, and uh, they're huge, and it's amazing. And I, I forget what they're called, but they're just beautiful and big. <clears throat> and uh, I actually, Show my mother how to use, um, you know, Apple uh, Photo Share. So she actually had sent me a bunch of photos, and I think there are some of those big pink things. And I definitely like to do. I could do a whole series on my parents' garden, man. It's pretty gorgeous. Or I was actually thinking about. Am I, should I say this? Hmm. Well. Uh, uh, doesn't matter. Are any crazy people on the internet gonna track me down? I was gonna say I was gonna do a bunch of paintings about where I grew up, like the actual. If I say the name, it'll be. It's kind of like sort of saying I don't know if I'm comfortable just sharing that on the internet, but around where I grew up, there was a kind of a park in a pond and it's where I learned how to skate as a kid and it's really beautiful people come there just to go for walks and um, I was thinking about doing a whole series on it I just got to think about whether or not I want to say the name just because it does sort of like maybe a little you know It's also important to have like maybe some areas of just some sim oops, is that any good? Simple colors. Like right now, I don't want to just go all Van Gogh and have super defined brush strokes. I want to play with different different stuff. Okay. Oh man, you know what? I bet you the whole time I've been in front of the goddamn canvas. I mean camera, you probably couldn't see much. Sometimes I forget. Let's try doing a bunch of little little marks. Let's see what it looks like. Because the little marks show that I care.
So all I'm doing is uh, blah, blah, blah. Okay, um, so let's take some green. Let's take some of the green I had from, um, what's that painting I was just doing earlier on? Uh, Birches of the Orange, number six, dude. And let's just throw in some thick green gobs of good paint. How quickly I go through that thick paint. It just like disappears right off the brush. Damn it. I really could have used more of this. Look at this crazy mix of mash of paints like oranges and green. Yeah, I love this thick paint. I think that's what was wrong with it before. It was, uh, it was too thin. In fact, I'm gonna go back into a bunch of paintings and goop them up. There's that one painting about uh, the Asylum Seeker or whatever it's gonna be called, the border, and it's too, th it's also painted very um, thinly. <clears throat> All right, it's getting a little bit too, a little scraggly over here. So let's see what happens if I draw some, some shapes into it. It's just, just was looking too uniform. So let's just, let's just do something. I don't even know what. Let's just come through here. And just do your stuff. Do your stuff. Hmm. Got to use my hands. Oh yeah, let's just need some life. Need some life into it, doesn't it? I think that's what's wrong with up here. There's just not enough life mixed in. Um, I don't even know if I like this color. What is this? It's like a dark 
dark green sort of what looks black almost. I bet you if I add some more white, it'll turn into a nice color. So that's the color that looks black. And if I take some white and mix it in, ooh, I was wrong. It's ugly. It's a sinful color. Looks like a drab crap gray. This is better. This is this is the color I thought I was getting. I thought I was getting that color. Yeah. Oh, yes. You were so much better. Oh, I don't color. You are so much better. Yes. Oh, I don't even know what I just did that for. Okay. Um, well. I'm just experimenting, seeing if my finger painting skills will create something interesting. And it is failing. So let's just take the palette knife and we'll probably get something better out of the palette knife. Yeah, I don't like those marks. Those marks are kind of gross. I feel like I'm petering out a little bit here. I, okay, I know it hasn't been an hour, but it's been 45 minutes, but I feel like I'm getting a little slow. metaphor that involves slowing down. Busy over here. It's too busy. I'm just being too busy. I'm too busy. These are just sort of wispy little who knows what. This be little, who knows what. Okay. Well, what should we do? Who am I talking to? draw shapes around. I think it'll help make this area sort of coalesce a bit. I thought, well, I'm going to do it later, mostly. I'm just going to do a couple now to remind myself to do it later.
feel a little bit out of breath. Take a break, please. All right, that's it. Oh my God, the whole time I was painting all over the place and probably didn't even see it. Yeah, I don't know. Something's pissing me off about this painting. What is it? Well, hmm. Down some of this white might be a good idea. Something beautiful is going to come out of this area. I know it somehow. Not quite there yet. Something. I'm gonna keel over, keel over, keel over. I'm gonna keel over if I don't stop soon. I say okay a lot. I keep on intending to stop. Okay. Huh, I just did it again. And, all right. Yeah, that's it. Okay. There we go. So someone was saying before how it looked like it was... The other one was a big painting. This is actually a big painting too. So if I go stand next to it, okay. So now I'm standing next to it, and I'm six, six one. I'm about three hundred and 
maybe 25 pounds, 350 pounds, I don't know. So that's how big this painting is. Anyway, that's it. I'm done. I'm taking a break. Oh, okay.